Hey guys, we're here in Kunming, Yunnan, and we're enjoying our dinner at an across-the-bridge noodles restaurant. This is a specialty of the region. What you got there, Ben? Nice noodles. So pretty much our waiter, <laughs> our waiter showed up with huge bowls of rice noodles, all by themselves, uncooked, and then handed us these little plates with the tiny little bowls on them. And in those little bowls were a raw egg and some pickled vegetables and mystery meat and some leaves You're and the like. The, uh, the appetizer. Oh right, we began with what we think is frog soup. And it was actually quite delicious if you could get past the rubbery scaly parts on the outside. It tastes like chicken. Anyway, so we had these nice little bowls of uncooked eggs and then you can see over here we had a stack of plates and on these plates were various slices of thin meat. All of it ident unidentifiable. Right, unidentifiable, unidentifiable and cut very, very, very thin so it'll cook quickly. Then finally, they brought us out these enormous bowls full of really, really, really hot broth. And as soon as they got here, as quickly as we could, we had to dump in the egg and the raw meat and everything else. And because it was so hot and the things were cut so small and thin, they cooked really quickly. So, while we've been here in Kunming, we've admittedly not seen too much yet because we've uh, been catching up on our stuff. But we can tell you that we've sampled a lot of the region's finest foods <laughs> and drinks, and we approve. Uh, the over the or, yeah, the across the bridge noodles, they're pretty good. <laughs> um, a bit scary at times. It's uh, it's kind of funny not knowing at all what's in your food, and when there's this much of it, lots could go wrong. But um, it tastes good. We've also had some of uh, Yunnan's coffee and the Pierre Pierre tea. Pierre tea. Both, and uh, regional delicacies, if you will. Um, Yunnan Pierre tea is actually probably the one of the uh, most famous teas in China. And for your Chinese people, if you're going to visit a friend that you haven't seen in a long, long time, or if you have someone coming to visit you, and you can't really afford to give them a big fancy gift. If you offer them just a cup of pu'er tea, then that's enough because it's such a special type of tea. The teas and the coffee grow really well down here because of the climate. Um, it's probably been the cleanest air quality we've uh, encountered so far in China and just an absolutely beautiful, perpetually beautiful climate, what they call it, the uh, eternal city of eternal spring. Yeah, or sometimes just spring city. Um, pretty much anything that has to do with springtime has been attached to this city. Flowers blooming. If you haven't noticed, every city or region in China has its own nickname. Um, nothing goes without a nickname. No. Nope. Uh, Shanghai has about six dozen of them. <laughs> Some of them a little unsavory and not repeatable. But uh, Kunming is pretty wholesome. It's one of the safest cities in China. The lowest crime rates. It's just beautiful, warm weather, and good food, although somewhat strange, and really nice people. It's actually home to the largest uh, population of ethnic minorities in China. In Yunnan province, in not Yunnan in Kunming province, city in Kunming, itself. But yeah, um, Yunnan itself. Uh, the people are all, as they were in Shanghai and Beijing and pretty much everywhere else, they've gone really eager to talk to us and practice their English. And we've um, had a good time so far. We can't wait to get done and caught up on all of our vlogs and actually get out and see a lot more of the city other than its food and drink. Great. So hopefully in the next couple days, we'll be finishing up some of our work and get a chance to see some of the more famous sites in the Yunnan region. Including muchos and muchos of tropical cars, so uh, <laughs> that's really excited to go see that. That's favorite type of landscape. So it should be really interesting. We're looking forward to sharing all of that with you guys soon. Until then... Bon appetit. <laughs> bon appetit. Have a nice cream for us at Hotlicks.